Hey everybody, it's here in New York. I'm on the roof of the atrium of the Brooklyn Museum. Really because I can. Um, I just got out of a fantastic talk with Michaela, Angela Davis, and Melissa Harris Perry. And one thing that really stuck in my mind from this, first of all, the fact that it's incredible that intelligence is finally coming back to television with Melissa Harris Perry's show on MSNBC which I hopefully will wake up early enough on Saturday to watch uh, because he is quite a, um, quite a figure and a very, a, a very, surprisingly very funny public intellectual. Um, but also the fact that at this point you're finally getting to the point, at least in my view, as someone who is multiracial, and I don't really talk about that a lot, and I don't feel it's necessary to talk about it here on this channel, but, you know, I would like to have some sort of multiracial or Hispanic or, you know, male feminist um, role model in entertainment, in media, and you know, I was reminded of how Michelle Nichols, who played Ahura on Star Trek, she was actually asked by Martin Luther King Jr. to remain on the show. She was planning on leaving after the first season, you see. Um, but then he said this is the only show that he and Coretta Scott King let their children watch. Um, so first of all, it's awesome that that Mars the King, one of the greatest men of the 20th century, was a, was a huge Star Trek fan. And B, it shows that intellect is very important, uh, or at least it was, and slowly but surely it is today, where you're able to have witty, intelligent teenagers, uh, such as, ideally such as myself, and that there are more and more people to support them. I'm getting rain on my camera. So yeah, that, that's basically all I wanted to say, and that I was sort of inspired by that. This is another one of those cultural reviews that I've been that I'm going to do every time I go to a museum. Um, also, that the fourth floor of the Brooklyn Museum is always something to behold. Um, between the Center for Feminist Art, which is again always inspiring. Um, even as a male feminist like myself. And also the period rooms, which are just really spooky on Thursday nights. I think I have to go because if I don't, I'm going to get wet because of the rain. I'll see y'all tomorrow.